Isabel Cloyster in North Wales Live. Welcome to North Wales Live, everyone. I am in Wrexham currently, just having, um, just having a good old look round. Really, see how much the town feels different now. Obviously, everybody's being um, very good and appears to be uh, listening to the government advice of staying in lockdown. A few people around the banks are still open, uh, supermarkets, of course, and any essential shops. Uh, walk past the bus station, which was incredibly eerie. I've never seen Wrexham bus station so quiet. With the new restrictions in place, things will be changing a little bit at the network, but we will continue to work hard to bring you all the latest news that matters most to people in North Wales. I've been playing a lot of board games. I've just started reading for the first time in a long time. Just picked up Louis Theroux's book. Uh, and I'm rushing my way through that because I can't put it down. So you'll have to recommend me something else once I'm done. Uh, totally rubbish with reading. It's one of those things that I often say that I should do more of and then never get around to it. Well, I suppose now is my chance. The usually busy Island Green shopping park, pretty empty right about now. A couple of the essential stores are still open, but as you can see, nothing like what it would usually be under normal circumstances. Of course, there is still uncer some uncertainty about how long this will all last, but it seems like so far, people are adapting really well. We'd love, of course, to hear about what's going on in your area community-wise. What are some things that maybe you've banded together to do? Maybe you're helping out vulnerable and elderly people in your community, or you've set up a socialising group online. Let us know if you've started doing something that you've been putting off for so long and then now with the time you're finally getting around to do it. I'm Alice Oliver, this is North Wales Live.